Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to optimize your Windows 11 system to get best gaming experience and best performance. The first and most important step in this process is to remove all fancy visual effects. As a gamer, I don't care about how my Windows look as much as how it performs in gaming. So right click on this PC and choose properties, click on advanced system settings, and open the settings of the performance section. Here as you can see, it allows by default a lot of fancy stuff that hurt our system performance. So click on adjust for best performance, and you may allow smooth edges for screen fonts and show some nails instead of icons. The first one is going to make the screen font look better, and the second one is very useful for images. It shows you image thumbnails instead of image icons. What we need to do next is to change the background. Most people don't know that fancy backgrounds that are large in size hurt the system performance. I've tried this several times on my old laptop, and I've noticed that changing the background image to black color always boosts the system performance. So go to personalization, choose background, change picture to solid color, and make sure it's on the black option. Next, go to personalization again, choose colors, turn off transparency effects, and change the light mode to Windows dark mode. Now go to the system section, choose power, and change the power mode to best performance. Go to the system section again, choose the storage, and make sure that the storage sense option is turned on. Click on the storage sense, and also make sure that the storage sense runs every week. This feature is great, it cleans up the temporary files on your system without having to do it manually like all times. Now go to the app section, choose apps for websites, and turn off all of these apps. Then go to Gaming, and turn off the Xbox Game Bar. Next, go to the Accessibility section, choose Mouse Pointer, choose Mouse, and click on Additional Mouse Settings. In the Pointer Options tab, turn off the Enhanced Pointer Precision, and click OK. Now we are done with these settings, and what we need to do next is to go to the Control Panel, search for Power Options, and change the power plant to high performance. Next, we need to optimize the startup apps. To do so, open the task manager by pressing alt Control del Go to the startup app section and disable all of the apps that are not useful to you, especially the apps that may consume a lot of resources of your PC. At this point, you will notice that your PC is much faster than before, but there is another tool that can help you gain more performance. So open up your web browser and search for This is Windows 11. Open up the first GitHub link and scroll down to the download section. Scroll down again and download the TIW11 file. Once it's downloaded, right click on it and extract all of its files. After doing so, open it up. Open the menu and click on Customize. Now click on the Check button and wait. As you can see, it tells me that there are 54 issues needs to be fixed. You can see these issues on the right side. And if you hover on one of them, it gives you more details about what is going to happen if you check on this option. So decide what you prefer to do and click on the blue button to fix these issues. Now all you have to do is to wait. Once it's finished, you can go to the app section to choose the apps that you don't like and want to remove. To select multiple apps, press on Control, and when you finish selecting, press on Move Selected and Empty Pen. Now it's removing all these apps for you. If you go to Packages, you will find that it can also download and install a bunch of useful apps for all needs. But anyway, let's go to the Automate section, and if you don't like OneDrive just like me, then you can check on Remove OneDrive, then press on Run Selected. Now we are done, but I noticed that the taskbar icons became very, very small. So to fix this problem, I've downloaded this patch file. I will leave all links in the description. And if you want these icons to be centered again, you can go to Taskbar Settings, choose Taskbar Behavior, and change the Taskbar Alignment to Center.
And that's it. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave them in the comments below. And thanks for watching. Bye.